Uh, today's subject is which religion is more authentic uh, between Islam and Judaism? Um, a few weeks ago, I load up a, a video. Um, a Judaism belief, you know, Abraham uh, offer uh, Isaac as a sacrifice and um, Islam belief, Abraham offer Ismail as a sacrifice. Now, <clears throat> uh, we know that, you know, uh, Abraham had uh, three wives. The uh, first one is Sarah. Next one is uh, Hagar, and the third one is uh, Kudura. And then, the um, Bible mentions most about Isaac, and um, Isaac married to Libga, and then um, between them, uh, Jacob, and then uh, Esau was um, uh, delivered. Then from Jacob, uh, there are you know, 12 sons uh, become 12 tribe. Bible didn't mention much about um, Ismael, but uh, Genesis, tw uh, Genesis uh, 25, they are saying, these are the generation of Ismael, Abraham's son, whom Hagar, the Egyptian, Sarah's servant, born to Abraham. These are the names of sons of Ismael named in the order of their birth. The first one is um, the Baniot, and however, that you know, all this, you know, are 12 sons, according to uh, uh, 16, they call 12 princess. Now, princess means that, you know, uh, then Ismail is king. So maybe uh, according to, according to uh, the, the princess means that, you know, the Genesis may be written, you know, uh, not by Moses. Now, after, uh, after you know, uh, you know, Abraham sacrificed, you know, one of the son or two sons, who knows? Then on chapter twenty-two, verse seventeen, that in blessing I'll bless thee, and in multiplying I will multiply thy seed as the stars of the heaven and sand which upon the seashore and they, uh, thy seed shall possess the gate of his enemy. Now, God promised to Abraham, I am going to make your children, your descendant, stars of the heaven and the sand in the sea. So, you know, so many of them. So, <clears throat> I check it out. Um, the population of nation of Israel, and uh, according to that, this is the uh, this is the uh, this is the list uh, of you know there uh, there are you know a flag and so uh, this is you know uh, China India. However, the the, the difference between uh, China and uh, India, it not not much. The, sooner or later, maybe in India, maybe uh, most you know, uh, popul in the population in the in the earth. Now, from this chart, as you can see, okay, here is Israel. You know, you can see you know a uh, king. Uh, uh, David star, and according to them, is nine million. Now, when I check the, you know, the nations, you know, uh, when when you talk about Old Testament, New Testament, 
And obviously, you know, on the you know, east side, there is uh, Egypt. And next went uh, uh, Jordan. And on the top, um, uh, Syria and uh, Palestine. And then um, next one is uh, Iraq and Iran and some Saudi Arabia in the peninsula. Then on the top, there is a Turkey there. And uh, however, that you know, uh, Jordan has a population of mixed uh, with different kinds of religion. Some believe in uh, Islam, some believe in uh, Christianity. So it's a mixed one. So uh, I omit in uh, uh, Jordan. Then it's uh, almost 400 million people. In other words, 40 times than the nation of Israel population. Now, based upon this population, who got more blessing from God? Do we have any kind of an answer? Obviously, Islam. So it's a contradictory. How come Islam get more population, more blessing from Abraham than Judaism? You think about this one, okay? Thank you so much for your watching.